All right, what is up guys? Professor Akali here bringing you a new video of the reworked Dark Harvest Karthus. Guys, in case you didn't know, the new Dark Harvest actually works so well with Karthus. Basically how it works now is when you cast a spell or attack a champion with anything, do damage to them when they're at 50% or lower health, you now do a ton of extra damage uh, proccing Dark Harvest. It's on a 40 second cooldown unless you actually get a kill and then it resets. But because of that, Karthus can just run into a team fight like he always does. His ult, even if he dies, he can proc Dark Harvest. It is so insanely good for that reason. So we're going to be testing this out in a video. I hope you guys enjoy because I really do think this is going to be the best champion for Dark Harvest. So without wasting more time, let's just get right into this. Uh, and just a side note, I am on vacation at my family saddle. Hold on. Oh, I guess I should have flashed that. Anyways, uh, yeah, I'm on I'm on vacation right now, so the setup I have doesn't have the best audio quality, so my apologies for that, but it should still be good. Uh, let's just go ahead and drop the E, and we're going to go ahead and just shove this whole thing in. If he decides to stay, um, that's okay. We're still going to take a lead regardless. But it looks like he... I mean, he should have stayed at this point. Uh, that's interesting. Either way, we're going to go back ourselves, and we're going to get some items. So I'm going to go ahead and just scroll over Dark Harvest so you guys can see exactly what it does now. Once I get some mana... All right, so basically here we go. So Dark Harvest, damaging a champion below 50% health deals 68 magic damage, so it's adaptive damage, and harvests their souls, permanently increasing Dark Harvest's damage by six, uh, and it just scales upward. Uh, but basically, as you can see at the bottom, I've harvest one soul so far, and we get six extra damage. So right now we're at uh, 61 damage plus six AP scaling. It has an uh, adaptive scaling, which means late game, it does so much freaking damage, it's absurd. Uh, so yeah, there's a lot of good things about this uh, this new Dark Harvest. Especially, honestly, it's it's really meant for champions that can get either people low in an AoE circle, or it's meant for people that are like assassins, that can do their upward burst and then uh, just proc it right after. Yeah, it's it's very good for mostly just mid laners, but our, in case you didn't see my Akali video on this uh, new rune, R.A.P. Dark Harvest Junglers. It's pretty much just not going to be good on junglers anymore, in case you're wondering about that. So that's just something to keep in mind. Go ahead and just... Yeah. And that is the best thing about killing a Yasuo. So the thing about Yasuo is that he does not have an escape. He can dash backwards if someone ganks from behind. But other than that, you know, he's going to be screwed. Like pretty much every time. Hold on, let's see. I'm actually going to go for a gank right here. Um, we should be able to kill him, as long as I don't waste too much mana. Nice, good poke. Okay, yeah, we're going to go for this right now. Uh oh. This is super sketchy. Okay, <laughs> uh, cool to see that the cane is just waiting at the corner. We're going to go ahead and just recall now. Um, that was super sketchy, actually. Well, anyways, we're going to go back now, and we are going to be picking up just a standard, uh, I guess, build. And I guess there's really two ways you can do it. You can go Tier, or you can go Rod of Ages. I think most people would go Rod as the safe option, but I think if you're a Karthus, like, one trick, you can go for the Tier, because it's a little bit, uh, it's, a, it's riskier, because you don't have the tankiness. But, you know, you can get away with it if you know exactly what you're doing. But Rod is always going to be a good option. Yeah. All right. We've, we, I'm the fake one. Okay. So, yeah, we're going to go back into this. Uh, of course, when you have the Vayne on your team, they are going to feed. So that's just nothing. Uh, it's nothing that we don't expect. So we're going to have to just carry right through this game. I just drop the spells on all of these people. Damn it. And, yeah, we do have some mana now. So we can work with uh, all of our stuff and just spam around. I don't think he gets it. Man, okay. Uh, now the question is, do I shove or do I just keep poking him out? Should be dead. Yeah, there we go. Dude, we were just, we were so abusing the fact that, oh, come on, don't you take that one. JK. Uh, I, don't, I don't actually mean that. But anyways, um, yeah, we were so abusing the fact that Yasuo is just literally the most immobile champion in the world. Uh, gonna have to just 
drop a few more cues to get this wave. Unfortunately, we have no mana left, but if I can get these minions, we do get mana off of Doran's Ring. Alright, and should be able to last hit this. Beautifully enough, you know, Karthus, rank 3Q, level 5, does 211 damage. Uh, so, this is definitely one of the best champions to get good with in League of Legends, like, period. There are, or at least there were a few patches ago, so many Korean one-trick uh, high elo players that one-trick Karthus. It's actually absurd at one point, and this was maybe two months ago when I checked. I haven't checked in a while. But they, there were more Karthus one-tricks in Challenger and Master Tier than any other champion by a mile. I'm, t I'm talking like like pretty much like, I, don't know, I think it was like 28 to 40 compared to like 11. I think Singe was the next one or something like that. Maybe really in Soul. But the point is, there are so many Karthus one tricks for a reason. You get good at him, it's it's rewarding. Nice. Nice right, Proc Dark Harvest. One more. Yeah, there you go. There you go. We hit Dark Harvest on him because we got him low enough to just proc it. Dude, I could ult him right now. I don't know if it's if it would work though. I don't want to waste it, unfortunately. Oh, come on. My Dark Harvest was down. Damn it. Okay. Are they trolling? I got the reset on Dark Harvest. Oh my god, this is the best Camille ever. I love you so much, Camille. Hold on, and now is Vayne actually going to be getting something? There's no way Vayne can get anything. That's just not how Vayne works. You feed, you, yeah, you feed when you play Vayne. This is exactly what I'm talking about. You can't, you can't possibly make it work when you play Vayne. What if I W? No, it doesn't do damage, unfortunately. Oh my god. Alright, we're popping off right now, dude. Oh, this is going to be so good. Because we've procking Dark Harvest so many times in the past, like, two minutes that it is already at seven stacks, and check it out now. Right now, it does one, uh, 124 plus nine damage, 150 damage, and that's just adding up to everything. It takes zero effort to proc it, and this is only with one. Actually, we just bought an item now. Let's see how much it does now. So what's the scaling now? Yeah, we get an extra nine on top of that. So we're doing 142 damage plus, uh, I think, the scaling. No. I'm just going to keep saying no. Uh, ult's not going to be up for 90 seconds. And at this point, this is where Karthus can really start running at people without being worried. Uh, we do have a little bit of tankiness. And the cool thing is, we last so long with this tankiness that even when we do die, you know, we, we can obviously go into our death, defiled, whatever, our passive, and just keep throwing spells afterwards. So much... It's not going to work for you, buddy. No, I didn't have mana. Oh, I wasted it with my E, dude. I wasted so much just draining with my E. Oh, come on. That was such a good close play, too. Okay. Oh, come on. Is this, is this really how I die? Oh no. Yeah, no, I, was, I wasn't even close. I was just kidding. Like, there's really no chance I die there. Please help me shove this in. Please help me shove this in. I don't have any mana. I'm just gonna keep autoing one at a time. Alright. Red buff, uh, do some work for me. Wait, wait, wait. Damn it. Dude, if you can get last hits on Karthus with your autos, you are a true one trick at this champion because he has the world's worst auto attack animation. Lucky? What do you mean, Kane? You suck. There's nothing, there's nothing more to it, dude. Oh, uh, whatever. Lucky. Oh, guess you know what? Huh? We have just enough gold to get the armor. And Zonia's is going to be so good in this game. JK, I am real one. I'm just worried they surrender at this point, because now that even... Actually, Balin's not even doing well. 25 CS. I'm just worried that they surrender. And I feel like, you know, if they know, they might, they might think I'm recording. They might not quit. So that, that's just my logic right there. Damn it. Yeah, we got it. Alright, and now we have the rank 5 Q, baby. Wait. 
That's death. You failed it! You failed it, dude! Oh my god, that is too good. She, oh, she, I guess she didn't know how long it takes to return. <laughs> Unfortunate to say the least. Right, let's take off these stupid little uh, new free gold, one, 160 gold thingies. Damn it. That was my own fault right there. I failed. I should have ignited later. I think I scared him off. I'm not sure. Oh my god! 400 damage! Alright, get rid of that stupid shield right there. Once again, got zero mana to work with. Well played. Well played. He's actually worth gold still. We got 88 gold for an assist. I thought it'd be worth a lot less. Anyways, um, if I can find a plant on the way to top lane, I think we can gank. Even though we have no mana, I feel like, yeah, yeah, this should be enough right here. This should be enough. Because all we have to do is wall and use cues. We don't have to use anything else. Damn, bot lane actually got the first turret anyways. I feel like we can, just, we can force this turret out. Shove this in right here. Should we have to just execute those? Alright. We're gonna go for these little uh, bone plating things. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I don't know if she actually thought that was gonna work, but maybe she just. Maybe she tried to outplay me. I don't know. She's 0 and 5 right now. I don't think that was a good idea. Anyways, uh, let's just continue on though. This is the PB, so as you guys know, as I say in all my videos, uh, just a disclaimer for you guys, because I feel like I should. Um, the skill differences between players in the PB are literally out of this world. Like, you never know what you're gonna get on your team or the enemy team. Um, sometimes, no matter what you do, you, your, your team could be so bad. Even if you're 50 and 0, you lose. Sometimes your team just wins in literally five minutes. It's just a complete toss up, like 100%. So I'm gonna think for that, please help drag. If anyone's recording, I want it to be known that at damn 12 minutes, Arcane yeah, executed to blue up. Oh my god, so funny. I love you. Dude, this Fiora, or this freaking Fiora is just shooting at their cane right now. Oh man, this bot lane is, yeah, they're good. Even though they're not doing that well, they're, they're team players for sure. I'm gonna go ahead and just drop the W. I think it reduces... What the heck? That was weird. Oh, I almost got that 25 gold seal. Wait a second. We can kill them all. We can kill them all right now. I think they're gonna run though. That's Dark Harvest? Yep, that's three shots. Oh my god! That's two! Can we please just kill one Q and then, and then he dies? care. Be gone. I'll take it. I'll take it. Um, we're gonna go mid. We're gonna go mid. Uh, at this point, the Kate is down for a little bit. The only player I'm really worried about in this entire game. Uh, so we're gonna take that advantage and we're gonna take that opportunity and we're gonna run it down. Um, unfortunately, yeah, no, we should have that. Minions are gonna be in time. We don't have to stop. Okay, so unfortunately, one sad thing about this. Oh, I'm gonna go ahead and just dive him. Holy crap. Thank you, bot lane. Thank you, bot lane. Uh, I'm gonna go take blue right now. I will not die to this. I will not pull a cane according to the Fiora. Well, mostly because I don't have to worry about dying to it. Anyways, we're gonna go back right now. Um, I'm not gonna pop over here because I don't think... I think there's still a ward there. Dude, this would literally be the best time in the world to ult. Oh my lord. Okay, the build is going well so far, guys. The build is going well. 
We got the Zonias because you you got to go for the Zonias against a full eighty team comp, except for Blitz, who is a support. So you know he's not gonna be getting gold anyways. He will probably one shot me though, to be honest. Like literally, Blitz AP Blitz does do insane damage to one person. That's as old as it. Oh my God! Smash him into the ground. Nice. <laughs> All right, that's good. This is good. Eleven, zero, and four. And I want to see how much the Dark Harvest does in a second. Oh. Wow, she blocked my Dark Harvest. Wow. Nonsense. Okay. Please don't kill me. Please don't kill me. Okay, let me poke you and you don't poke me. Oh shit. Okay. Uh oh. Good poke. Just gotta queue up the poke. And I'm backing up. You know what's fine actually? We're really tanky for this to the Caitlyn. Our shield's down. I'm gonna go ahead and shut this wave in. Give me that cannon. Nice. All right, I think it's time to go back. Is it? This is really sketchy. Hold on, get rift. Um, B. Oh no. Holy wombo. It's fine. We're gonna prombo everyone as well. Dark Harvest is available again. I just don't have literally any mana to do anything. Oh, I'm dead. This is this is unfortunate. Help me. Help me. Please. No. <laughs> that was not even close at all, dude. What are you doing? <laughs> like, I had literally calculated that entire fight hours ahead. But even before I even queued up and knew who was on the enemy team. Or my team. Let's get out of here. You're worth 1,000 gold? Oh my god. If I kill you, I'm full build. He's right, actually. I mean, not at all, but still. Uh, please leash. Please. No mana. I got no mana left. I want to see how much Dark Harvest is going to give us in just a second. Right now, it's giving us 284 extra damage on every single uh, time we proc it. God, this is going to be the best. This is so good on Karthus, too, because it scales so well into late game. Well, that took a long time. All right, let's get out of here. That is warded. Definitely don't want to die to that. Man, if Dark Harvest procs before I ult in, that would be so nice. Oh, actually, let's go, for, let's go for this. I think Void Staff, you can't go wrong with it. All right, give me that gold. Yes, thank you. Whoa, and Kane's down to half health, with even though he has a bunch of health. And the assist, 150 on that, dude. This is beautiful. The thing is, at this point, when Karthus snowballs, they can't fight at all. Because it's pretty much you're fighting with half health. Like, I guess that's a pretty way of describing it. Because you really are just fighting with half health. Because no matter what, Karthus can ult you. Unless you're Fiora, unless you're like Elise or Fizz or a few champions that can avoid it, you're going to be in a terrible spot. What the hell is he doing? Oh, I think he's trolling. I think he's giving up now. Well, when I hit my E, I just killed them. I don't know if you guys noticed, but I didn't Q them for that execute. I literally just auto E'd them. Hey, people, it's support. I'm so done. Okay. Let's go for the win now. Camille, one shot the Fiora. No, damn it. Missed the Q. And I did not see that. Uh, you're all dead. Nope. Oh. oh my god. Holy crap, that was a play. Wow. Dude, that was the best Sona ult I've ever seen. That was just that was just really good timing, I guess. 
Anyways, all right guys, that was the reworked Dark Harvest Karthus and it is so good. You can proc it from across the map, wherever you want, baby. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please be sure to leave a like. It really helps a lot. Subscribe if you're new. And I'm out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in a new one. Also, I only have one monitor, so I got to do this. All right. Have a good one, everyone. Yeah. Peace.